What is a radian? Well, in our everyday lives, and in this video, we've described angles using the unit of degrees, which has that little circle symbol above the number. Here are some angles measured in degrees. But in physics, we sometimes use the unit known as radians, which we write as RAD. Here are those same exact angles measured in units of radians. These numbers look a little weird, although that last one might look familiar to some of you. So what's the relationship between degrees and radians? One full circle, if you make one full revolution, has 360 degrees. It also has two pi radians, where pi, if you remember, is the circumference of a circle divided by its diameter. So here's our conversion. 360 degrees equals two pi radians. Okay, but what is a radian and why are there two pi radians in a circle? Let's take a look. Let's say we have a circle and the radius is some number that will represent with the variable r. Now we take the length of that radius r and we bring it outside the circle and we bend it or wrap it along the circumference. Now if we draw a line from the center of the circle to where that ends, we form an angle inside the circle. The value of that angle right there is one radian. And for reference, that's about 57.3 degrees. So pretty interesting. So when we count the number of radians in a circle, that's how we end up with two pi radians, which is about 6.28 radians. You might notice the similarity to the equation for the circumference of a circle. Circumference equals two pi times the radius. Let's do one quick example of converting between degrees and radians. Here we wanna convert 68 degrees to units of radians. Well, we know from before that 360 degrees equals two pi radians. And we'll use the same method that we learned before for converting between units. First, we write our starting amount, which is 68 degrees. Then we write our equal amounts. And since we wrote our fraction with degrees on the bottom, we can cross out degrees on the top and bottom. And we're just left with the units of radians. Last, we just do the math. 68 times two pi divided by 360 equals 1.19. So 68 degrees is equal to 1.19 radians.